What is going on you guys? Oh my god, I can't believe I'm doing this video because I've literally been trying to film this for the longest. I know, I've been like telling you guys I'm gonna do this video and just has not been able to like go my way. Actually, one of my next goals is to be consistent on here. I feel like social media has been like this all year for me. Like, I love what I do. I love it. But when you have like all this whole other life like going on like in the background or like your real life, um, it's just, it can be easy to fall off a little bit just because there's just so much going on and it's like, Social media is a full-time job. Like, it is 100% a full-time job. So, like, you really, really need to be, like, consistent, stay on top of it. And, yeah, I mean, there's just been a lot going on this year that has made me, like, sometimes not be as consistent and then, like, try to be consistent and then fall off a little bit. And, yeah. But I'm here right now and we're going to be consistent. So I'm speaking into existence. Speaking on the topic of social media has been like this for me. Um, I had actually done some Q&A's on my IG that I never even answered your guys' questions. Like, I literally would put the question box and then I did, didn't have a chance to get back to them and, like, answer them throughout my day. So I started, like, taking screenshots of, like, like a lot of questions that I was seeing and I was like, okay, I'm gonna, like, do this video so that they, like, and I'll answer it there. So that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. I'm just going to be answering those questions that you guys have been asking me on my instagram and just things i haven't updated you guys with so just like any other regular human i go through many hardships as well um this year has been a huge learning experience year with many different things that have happened but it's also been a year that's taught me to like push through you guys are aware of a few of the things that have happened um a few <laughs> one or two i feel like right now i'm at a point where i'm like okay do you guys want to know like the good news or the bad news <laughs> so i'll i'll start with the bad news just because so for those of you who don't know i was in a car accident this year in august and they had t-boned me and yeah my car swirled and all of that but thank god thank god thank god overall like i was okay um i was injured in the accident but overall obviously i'm still here so i am very thankful and with that being said um i haven't really updated you guys on like that progress because i know you guys like see me starting to work out and stuff so i'm still not fully healed from my injury and um i have been seeing a chiropractor for these last few months and because the pain of like where i got hit and like my hip area and stuff um and lower back um it still hasn't healed fully to where i used to be at actually it's you know affected me a lot and like a lot of things like i can't sit down for long periods of times because when i'm sitting down for long periods of times like the pain starts to flare up or if i try to go like really heavy like back to the like to the weight that i used like i was used to doing like the pain starts flaring up again so there's like different stuff right um that i'm still not really able to do that much like how i normally used to do before i got injured um so with that being said I have to go get an MRI scan for that area and according to the chiropractor I do have to see a specialist to get my final results but um, there is a possibility that I might have a permanent damage um, so yeah again it when I heard that news I was just like you're kidding me like uh, I wanted to start crying like I was just like are you serious like you know, and especially because, like, my life also, like, I'm a very active person, you know, so it revolves around, like, working out, like, lifting weights, like, doing this, doing that. So even, like, the thought of that, too, was, like, kind of scary because I was, like, like, are you kidding me? And, like, even from, like, what, you know, the chiropractor doctor had told me, too, like, you know, these are sometimes things that, like, you know, don't really, you don't really get this type of problem until, like, you're old, you know, but the issue is, like, I mean, you know, I'm still really young, so yeah i'm just hoping and praying that i'm i have a lot of hope that you know things are gonna go well with like 
my specialist yeah. and that I'm going to get the results that is going to be best for me. So yeah, that's that with that situation. Um, and yeah, with that being said, like how I told you guys in the beginning, you know, I've had a lot of life learning experiences this year. Um, and, but nevertheless, aside from all the other hardships that have been going on this year, I am here and I am healthy and my family's here and my family's healthy. So that's really what's most important to me. Everything else, we gonna get through it. Like how I've told you guys before too, just like pushing through those things. Like everyone goes through problems. Everyone goes through like, you know, different hardships. But um, it's just, you know, it's a matter of not letting these negative things like bring you down. Um, maybe some things are out of, you know, your control. <laughs> maybe some things you have control over but regardless like it's up to you like how you choose to you know react to those situations that you go through so um, i do have though good news so these are like new updates that you know i'm excited and i'm happy about one of the questions i had gotten was um if i have gotten a new if i got a new car after my accident and yes mm -hmm, i recently I got a new car um but actually so i honestly okay yeah i guess like i got the car but my angle is actually to give it to my mom so i got this car like with the intentions of giving it to my mom at the end just because i couldn't find the car of how i wanted it like i was just being like super picky i'm not even gonna lie like i was being really picky and honestly i don't know if you guys have heard about like the shortage like going on of like the chip and all of this stuff and like right now all the cars are like crazy like buying a car right now is like probably the worst time ever to buy a car so yeah i mean i had no choice because i had to get a car regardless but i was like okay you know what um i'm gonna get this car and this car is actually going i'm gonna gift it to my mom you know um once this comes down so maybe within a year or so. Um, but I guess, yeah, for now I have a car. Um, and I'll like, I'll show you guys my car. It's, it's a cute little SUV. Again, <laughs> I actually got the SUV cause like my mom likes SUVs. So regardless though, I'm super excited for the car. It is so cute. My mom loves red, so I don't know. Honestly, she didn't really pick it out. She didn't, she had no, 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 no clue at all whatsoever, but I just got whatever I thought she was going to like and yeah. So I also have gotten a lot of questions in regards to trading. So just let me tell you guys from the get go, like this whole new trading world, it's like, this, it's hard, okay? And it requires, I mean, just like anything, like it requires a lot of consistency. Like if you're not trying to learn and do it like all the time or watch videos or ask questions or get a mentor, like this is, I mean, you're able to learn on your own, but I mean, but I mean, you have to have some type of guidance because everything's like, at least for me, like it, it's been pretty hard and I've been trying to like really learn this and get the hang of it for a while now. And it wasn't until like I started like committing more to it and like watching the videos and actually like practicing like all the time is how I actually started understanding it more and like learning. I'm not a pro <laughs> by any means, but I'm definitely learning. I'm definitely getting better at it. And most importantly, I'm actually understanding like what I'm doing. So yeah, that's been another cool little new thing going on. And then the last question that everybody keeps asking me, like if I moved to LA and the answer is drum roll. Um, no, I didn't. I didn't move to LA. Uh, I know it seems like it because I'm always out there. You guys always see me post like I'm out in LA. So I do go to LA a lot and I'm going to start being there a lot more often now. Um, so I guess the last, good news I have for you is um, I started a new business venture and I started a new company, an Airbnb company out there. So I officially got my first property and I am super excited. It's just With been, yeah, it's been a little hectic in the beginning and like, it's just crazy to even like think about it. Cause like this had literally been one of my like goals for like this year 
and the fact that like you know i was able to um start it this year is just i don't know it's just super exciting it makes me really really happy and yeah so that's why i have been a lot in la just and i mean other little ventures going on too that i'll eventually talk about when they happen but um but yeah so that's the secret that everybody's been wanting to know if i move to la and so i mean i guess i guess i mean i, I stay out there i have a place to stay whenever i want so i mean kind of but yeah so let me know if you're trying to go to la because i got a spot <laughs> And yeah, overall, I'm just super excited. I'm super happy I was able to do this video just because it's been like long overdue. And I just want to thank you guys for all your support. And I want you guys to let me know what you want to be seeing more on here and on my Instagram. And don't worry, I'll be coming back soon because I already know. I already know you guys are coming for me because I've been needing to do these videos. Getting back on my YouTube game. I'm coming. I'm coming. And then even Instagram because... It's, it's been a it's been a little roller coaster with it too but anyways thank you so much for your guys' support don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and then i will be seeing you guys on my next video